final round of the 2011 Honda Classic, PGA National Resort and Spa, the champion course at Palm Beach Gardens, and what a tough test all week long for these players. Graham McDowell, though, with the wins down in the final round, chasing the course record. Par 3, 17th, final hole of the bear trap, and what does McDowell have? A birdie. Finishes with another at the closing par 5, and a 64. Tommy Ganey also at 18, picking up birdie coming in, moves him to three under and into the top five. Ricky Barnes, how about this play? Out of that lush Bermuda, into the cup at 16, making the bear trap look a bit easier than it has the past three days. Barnes finishes fourth alone, best of the day at the par 3 15th, Y.E. Yang. The South Korean winning his first PGA Tour event here in 2009, and he likes the bear trap. What a beautiful strike and an easy birdie for Yang. He would have three birdies coming in, challenging our leader, Rory Sabatini, who began the day with a five-shot advantage, but here he is at 16, and the gap shrinking, down to just a one-shot advantage at this point. What a timely hit for Sabatini to the top tier and this for birdie. Back to a two-shot advantage. Boy, did he need that, taking that to the 18th. Yang here at the closing par five, trying to get within one. He would make birdie and wait to see what Sabatini would do. But first, Jerry Kelly, also in the final group. Kelly with two birdies on the front would close with birdies at 17 and 18 to climb to seven under par as he adds birdie here at the last best finish of the year for Jerry Kelly and into the top 25 in FedEx Cup points. But the day belonged to Sabatini as he would have birdie at 16, a pair of pars coming in and for his sixth PGA Tour victory, the winner at nine under par. Join us Thursday, first round action of the Cadillac Championship, 2 p.m. on Golf Channel and the Puerto Rico Open, 6.30 p.m. first round coverage on Golf Channel.